Hello YouTube, I'm back again with another very easy recipe for your baby's first foods. These videos are to show that nobody needs to purchase baby food from the store. You can make everything at home organically by yourself. So what you're going to do is you're going to get a pot of water, bring it to a boil, and pour in about a cup of your favorite oats. Don't be afraid to add some spices like cinnamon and nutmeg so that your child can get acclimated to those ingredients as well. One cup of oats will last a very, very long time. So make sure you have enough containers to freeze the excess. We use old fashioned oats, so they take a lot longer to prepare. It usually takes about 15 to 20 minutes in order for the oats to get very soft. And you wanna make sure that your spices are completely incorporated prior to turning off your stove. Once you've let your oatmeal cool a little bit and you've let the water absorb, now you know that you are ready to blend it. If you have an older child, maybe eight or 10 months old, you may not need to blend it, but for my baby who's just starting to eat, the clumpy oats could be a choking hazard. So we put it in our Nutribullet baby and I realized right away that it is too thick. So I had to add a little bit of water to thin it out. You at this point could also add some fresh fruits, whether it be strawberries, bananas, oranges, anything that you would like in your oatmeal as an adult, you can give for your baby. At this point, we have a, a paste, I call it, that is the consistency that my child will be able to swallow without his teeth. You can always do a taste test and also a scoop test to measure that the consistency is as you'd like. You can always pour in a little bit more water if it's not up to your standards, but you will be able to pour lots of it into containers for the fridge that can be used this week for one of their meals and put the rest in the freezer for later. Thank you so much for tuning in. See you next episode.